If you're struggling to make columns inside a column or columns inside a toggle, you're not alone. This workaround should help you out. Hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell to stay part of the conversation. So when you create a toggle list in Notion, you can do it different ways, but when you put data in that toggle list, it goes in one single column. Then when you try and drag it across to make two different columns, it actually takes it out of the toggle box. You can drag it straight back in, but it will go back into that single column. So a workaround for this is to actually create a page inside the toggle block. Once you've created that page, you're then going to drag all the information into that page. This is where you're going to do all of your formatting, so we're going to create three different columns. Then when we go back to our original page, with the page in the toggle, we can go to the side of the page block, turn into, and then turn into text. What this does is turn the page into text, so you've just got the word page, but it also throws out everything that was inside the page. You can get rid of that page, and now you have three columns inside that toggle block. I typically use this workaround in a different situation. If for example I want notes on the left side of my page, and then I want my main work in a different column, I can write my title in that column, but then when I want to have subtitles in columns underneath that title, the same issue happens in that when you try to put that subtitle across, it will move the whole title across as well. So again we can use that same workaround by creating a page, putting the subtitles in the page, doing our formatting in there, going back to the main page with the title, turn into text, and then what I typically do is turn the page into a divider. This way I now have title, subtitles in columns, and then I have my toggle notes at the side. I actually use this workaround in my content calendar video. Check that video out over here and I'll see you there.